you can't hit on the Spurs. You can't. Uh, 15 straight years of 50 plus wins. Four championships. Five finals appearances. It looks like they're rolling their way to another finals appearance. Back to back years. When they still have that taste in their mouth of what should have been the, the franchise's fifth championship last year. If not for a Ray Allen magical shot that propelled the Heat to their second three championship third overall. That being said, why do the Spurs always get a free pass? Always. I know Greg Popovich is great. I know they win. I know all of what I just previously said. They're the team that went to seven games in round one, not the Heat. They're the team that played a Trailblazers team that might be the youngest in the league. They're the, that might have been the youngest in the postseason. They're the team that played that is playing a Thunder team without one of the best defensive players in the league. But they get a free pass when they're bad, and when they're good, they're the best team ever. Listen, the Miami Heat haven't played well, but maybe they're playing better teams. I mean, the Nets were a team with a bunch of Hall of Famers. The, Net, the Pacers are a team that was the best team in basketball most of this year. So before we just run and say how great the Spurs are and how bad the Thunder is, eh, okay? First of all, the Spurs are looking so great because the Thunder are so bad right now. Second, my other issue is, when do we give the sidekick more crap than the star? Russell Westbrook's always blamed for their losses. Why not Kevin Durant? Isn't he the MVP? Isn't he the clear-cut second-best player in the league? When LeBron James was messing around, they didn't blame Mo Williams. When Jordan ever had an off game, they didn't blame Scottie Pippen. You know, when LeBron, when LeBron now in Miami, the Heat lose, they don't blame Dwayne Wade. They might ask if Dwayne Wade is healthy, but they don't blame him. They always blame the superstar. In every sport, they blame Peyton Manning. They never blame Reggie Wayne. But for some reason, the Oklahoma City Thunder, they never blame Durant. Because we don't like Westbrook, we love Durant. I don't care. Durant's been in the league long enough now. They should start getting some blame. Yeah, Ibaka's down. They're not the same team. Shouldn't he step his game up instead of scoring 15 points? San Antonio Spurs are a great team. The Thunder are playing horrible. We should blame Durant a little bit, and maybe sometimes we should question the Spurs instead of always giving them so much credit. This is the Loop Tube.